Hi, my name is Ken Williamson with Newmark Corporation, and we're here in Napanee, Indiana, and I get the distinct privilege of introducing the brand new 2017 King Air. One of the things you're going to notice we've done on the London Air Essex King Air, we've got the new hydraulic step system. So one of the great features about this step is it has a control on the front of that. If you just tap that, if it hits something, it'll automatically close itself. It's not going to run anything over. It's going to go right back into the system. It also, if you were pulled up next to a curb, it will stop when it hits that curb. So it's not going to extend. It's not going to go back in. So it makes it real easy getting in and out of the coach. So a couple of really neat features we also did is right inside the door here is your battery disconnect. So I don't, I don't have to climb into the coach and turn everything off. I can do it from right here. On the King Air, just like the Essex and the London Air this year, you're going to have the electronic stability control. So it's giving you a great feel for that coach when you're going down in dangerous situations. You're going too fast around an on-ramp. You're in bad weather. It's going to use the braking system, the Jake brake, and the air system to really help you keep control of that system. And that's called electronic stability control. You're also going to have the Cummins diagnostic system. So you can subscribe to that. So anytime you had a code come up on your dash, it's going to automatically notify them. Cummins will contact you and tell you, you just need to change your oil, you need to get in for major service, and they can tell you whatever it is. So as we walk back through, you're really going to notice some changes on this coach. And that gave us the ability to do that because we customized that star foundation just for the King Air. So you have your optional power pressure washer here, and then you've got huge storage area just to put anything you want. As you notice, we're going to start stepping back through. Very similar to last year, you're going to maintain your 200-gallon fuel tank, which is a huge benefit to our customers. You're going to have our power pass-through storage. You're going to have that huge height in there, so you've got a lot of benefit of the, of the storage facility. Then you're going to have another power pass-through, and it's going to be a little bit smaller than it was last year, but we're going to gain that in other places. So now what we've done, you got your power pass through, goes both ways. So your next compartment is going to be your exterior refrigerator freezer. And it's going to be mounted sideways and goes back to front. So now what we've done is, is especially when we get to the other side, we've really configured this completely different. Your hydronic heat system is going to be right behind that. And then you're going to see some of the benefits on the other side. So as we step back to the next compartment, this is going to be completely different from the other years. What we've done here, we've got a slide tray that goes completely across the coach. This is going to put 16 of your, this is going to be an all electric coach, and you got your 16 gel cell batteries. The benefit of doing this is it's taking the weight off the front end of the coach, giving you a much better drive going down the road. We're really balancing this coach, and that was the whole idea of going to the Star Foundation. So as we continue around on the door side of the coach, you're going to see your 15 gallon DEF tank fill. And again, like everything else we did last year, you've got DEF fill on both sides of the coach. This is a Spartan chassis, so you're going to have the Spartan service center. You're going to have your air dryer, your fuel filter, your batteries, your chassis disconnects. You're also going to have, you're going to have an air release on your rear engine compartment. So we step around to the back side of the coach. I think the first thing you're going to notice is gorgeous new rear cap. Um, you've got all LED tail lights, everything. You've got a real high brake light up here. It's just a tremendous look. But not only is it a great looking coach, it's very functional. Okay, so a lot of those same features we talked about on the other products are going to be standard on the King Air also. 20,000 pound towing capacity. Then you're going to have your auxiliary air system so you can tie into that to the coach vehicle your, or the tow vehicle you've got with you. You've also got the option for the camera select for your, if you had a stacker trailer, you can hook those cameras into the coach and see those on the front dash monitors. One of the new things you're going to see this year if you see this camera right here, this has got a 360 panoramic view of the coach now. So when I'm sitting driving down the road and I'm sitting at the driver's seat, it almost looks like I have a camera 20 or 30 feet above the coach and I can see two lanes on either side of the coach and 15 to 20 feet in front of and behind the coach. So if a car's coming in there, or somebody's walking by there, it's a really neat new feature that you can set up on your dash in the front of the coach because we've got a completely new digital dash I'm excited to show you about. So let's step onto the door side of the coach. 
Again, we talked about that battery access tray now. So you have those 16 coach batteries, which are really heavy. And we got those off the front axle of coach, making a much better riding coach. This is gonna access, I can act, slide it out this way and I can access eight batteries, slide it out the other way and access the other eight batteries. Then I step forward into my water compartment. Very similar to what it's been before. I've got the Manablock plumbing system. It's fully insulated with the optional turbo system now with the, the turbo uh, SantaCon system. Gonna pump twice as fast. But this is one of the best laid out, easiest to use compartments I believe in the industry. It's just everything's there, easy to get to, easy to function. So as we step to the next compartment, a lot of this is gonna be completely different than what you're used to. This is your power cord compartment. You're gonna have that option for that 30 amp plug for the tow vehicle if you're gonna use that. But some of the neat things you're gonna see if we've taken those inverters that were out in front before and tucked them into this compartment here. So it really gives you easy access to this and gives us a lot more storage toward the front of the coach. Now one of the huge benefits of being able to move those batteries to the back, now you have a huge open storage compartment here. So all the things you need, you wanna store inside here, great access to easy storage right inside here. So even though it's completely different, we believe you've actually gained some storage on this coach with this chassis. And that's why we're really excited about the drive, the functionality, and what we've been able to access with the basement on going to the K3 GT chassis. So as we walk around the exterior of the coach, I think I've shown you a lot of new things between the front caps, the rear caps, the chassis, electronic stability, all the good stuff. Wait till we get inside and I show you all the stuff in there because there's a lot more to show you. Come on in. Welcome to the inside of the 2017 King Air. And I really don't know where to start because there's so much new stuff to talk about. You've got a completely redesigned new dash, new grab handle coming in, um, new design. You're gonna, everything you're going to see is really going to be new. Um, double stitch dash. It's got the leather look and feel. Just a tremendous high quality and, and look. But I think the biggest thing you're going to notice is that front dash. Um, it is completely different. You got a 12.1 silver leaf digital dash. Um, then you're going to have two 10 inch monitors next to it. So you're going to have your, your camera system, your navigation system, your radios, all going to be so easy to control and touch and use. Um, and then with your dash, it's controllable. You can program it to how you want it to show, how you want it to look. And it's got some really cool features. Um, so you can go in here and this is your standard configuration. It's going to give you everything you want to see. Your, your miles per gallon, your RPMs, your turbo, your transmission, your volts. And then on the bottom th third of the screen, you can monitor anything you really want to inside there. One of the cool things you've got now is what's called perimeter view, the 360 perimeter view. And I'm going to do that and on the front dash, it's going to give you what looks like a camera that's 20 or 30 feet over the top of the coach. So I can see two lanes to the left, two lanes to the right, and in front of the back of the coach. We've always had the passenger side navigation system. And what we've done is we've taken from that front overhead, which is still on the Essex and product, and we've moved it to here. One of the cool things you're also going to have is, is on the King Air, you're not going to have the Vorad anymore. You're going to have a collision mitigation system. So you're going to have um, on guard. And what that's going to do, it's actually going to, the, the Vorad's a great system and it warns you and it'll slow you down if someone's slowing down in front of you. This collision mitigation system will actually use the brake system and start stopping you if something's in front of you. So if a coach or a car or something stops in front of you, it's going to act, warn you and then start actually using the brake system to start slowing the coach down. We've always had in the last two years or last year and a half, we've had your charging pads. What we've done is just made it a lot more convenient, laid it right up on the dash right there. What's really cool is that it's going to charge my phone, but it's on a no stick pad or no slide pad, so it doesn't move around. So even though it looks like it's going to slide off, it's really not. It was designed really, really great. You notice when we open the door, the LED lights come on just like they did last year, but we modified this whole cabinet. We brought everything down lower so it's much easier to access, much easier to get into. So again, you're gonna have your silver leaf system like we had in the last few years. So it's really easy to get to function. You're gonna have your diagnostics. So rather than telling the customer that, or telling a service tech, hey, my generator started at two in the morning. My 
all he has to do is plug in here and the silver leaf is going to be a, a, a troubleshooting system and tell him exactly what's going on with the coach. So it's really going to save you time. Okay, so as we step back through, this is a no, new 4584 floor plan. And what that does for us, it gives us a mid-coach 49-inch 4K TV, just like we had last year. One of the neat things is the bedroom TV, the outside TV, and the front overhead TV, optional front overhead, are also going to be the 43-inch 4K TVs. But as we come through, this is the 87-inch side opening sofa. So it's going to have a new gel mattress in there. It's going to be really comfortable, but it's open sideways. And then you're going to have a power jackknife sofa on this side. And what we've done, if you notice, most our, a lot of our floor plans in the last couple of years had the televator. Well, th by doing the televator, which is a great feature, it made the coach a little bit tighter when you're going down the road with the slides in. With this floor plan, we open that back up, put the TV in the middle of the coach. You've got an optional fireplace underneath it. But it really, when the coach is all closed up, you still have a tremendous amount of room to walk through here. So a nice new feature this year is you got the motion sensor enable switch. So if I got up in the middle of the night, I would walk through the coach and this would sense me walking through and my courtesy lights in the floor would come on automatically. So one of the really neat things as we step back into the kitchen area, you're gonna notice it's a flush cooktop. So we've gone to the optional, when you do the optional induction cooktop, that's gonna sit down inside of here now. So when you're not using it, you can set your panels over there, or you can use one side or the other and still have flush countertop. So it gives you a tremendous amount of more uh, countertop. And what's really cool now is this entire system, you can unplug this, pick it up and take it outside and put it on your uh, picnic table and use it outside there. So then put that back on there and still use it for storage or whatever you want to do, place your food or whatever on top of here. So one of the really cool new things we did, again with the King Air like we've always done, you're going to have the self-closing drawer guides. So it automatically closes. You don't have those latches, you don't have any, it's just a real high-end touch when you step into the King Air. One of the things you're going to notice, that new farm sink. It's got a beautiful one-piece stainless sink, which is just huge and absolutely gorgeous. So completely new this year. We're still going to do the touch faucets. We're still going to do all those high-end features, but really just give it a completely different look this year. As we step back through, this is a 4584. Put your washer and dryer up in the front of the coach. Makes it very easy to access, everything to use. And again, the Essex and the King Air are going to have that 220 dryer, which is really important if you want to use it and dry a lot of clothes. So as we step back through, some of the really cool things we did this year We've got that hinge door that we've done for a couple years. We've got a new handle on this. So what it's gonna do is it's flush now, so it's gonna even give you a little bit more room to open. We've done a much heavier duty hinge on that self-hinging pocket door, so it's a real easy access into the mid bathroom. As we step into the bedroom area, you're gonna notice it's the same layout as we had last year, but really, really went over well. The huge amount of storage you have, the 49 inch 4K TV, the drawers everywhere, um, it's just really, really popular. And then on the, what we've done here is just gave you a huge residential look and feel. And then you step over to the other side and you've got your bedroom area. So you've got a huge bed. And one of the neat things we did last year is all your fabrics in the King Air are Ralph Lauren fabrics. So it's a real high quality product going in there. So as we step into the rear bathroom area, a lot of really neat things to talk about. Again, this is a completely different configuration. You're still going to maintain your double sinks, a lot of storage underneath. Like we did last year, anytime you open a deep cabinet, the LED lights will automatically come on. I don't know if you noticed it or not, but the, the lights came on when we walked in here. Those accent lights in the floor, and I know the camera didn't catch that, but it's one of those really neat new features this year. You've got a huge ward all the way across the back of the coach. You've got a, a design shower that we completely did last year. It's a very large residential. It's got the Fresca shower system. So it's got the, it, you can, the massage on your feet, your face, your head, anywhere you want it. Um, it's a very residential, great looking system. Um, one of the hard things, I know it's gonna be difficult for you to see, but the entry or the egress door really dressed that up much, much nicer this year. So it really looks residential. You can't hardly even tell it's there except for your lock and your handle. Um, so that's the uh, 2017 King Air. I hope you liked it. We're really excited about it. 
So give us a call at 800-852-1731 or visit us at newmarkcorp.com. We'd like to share a lot more information with you. Thank you very much.